Hi everyone, thanks for tuning in to the Vector Builder how-to videos. In this video we're going to show you how to change uh, the shape of your vector field with the supplied vector field textures. Uh, so basically, as always, find the vector field that you want to start from. And I've went ahead and picked it and duplicated it as my P underscore awesome vector field. And as you can see, you scroll down through, you have lots of vector fields to choose from to try. The, the colored ones here, the non-green ones here, are um, test uh, pre-made systems, uh, styles, animated vector fields to uh, to play with to change out these textures to see the different shapes that they they create. So let's do that now. So I went ahead and selected my awesome vector field, and I will go to the local vector field setting and go to um, all the different possibilities is in this folder under vector fields. And you see there's uh, I believe 88 of them. Uh, so you have 88 different generated texture fills that are all unique. So let's go ahead and change those out and see what we can achieve here. So I'll go ahead and go to 76. That's pretty cool. Let's try 70. 75. Okay, it's different. We keep changing until we see the ones that we like. Okay, that's different. Let's keep going. Okay, cool. As you can see, there's lots of different possibilities. And I, I've got this set up for all the different... Um, all the different uh, particle systems so you can sit there and just see these settings how they react with different fields because each field is different and unique so they cause the particles to dance around a little bit differently and you get different kinds of effects so you can see all the things I'm just changing a field and drastically changes the look of the effect so we'll keep moving moving on here some pretty cool ones like tentacles and then uh, some ground effect one there if we look from the top here you go Let's keep changing out the different ones. That's pretty strange. You can sit there. I love just doing this all day long. You can sit there and just keep looking at different combinations, different vortexes, different sizes, and see what they create by changing it all out. That's pretty interesting. And let's go here. 58, 57, 56. Some of these uh, fields will look different with different, uh, look better than others on different of these uh, effects that I have pre-made for you. So let's see what else these make. That's pretty cool. Let's get down to, let's jump down to the 49. Some of those branches we have in there. Okay, that's pretty wild. Let's try number 47. Now that's pretty crazy. That's pretty cool. So there's some side vertexes there. So basically, that's the uh, the fun is going through all these um, the vector field choices to see uh, how they react. And again, you can open the demonstration levels up to see um, what those vector fields look like themselves. As you can see, there's a ton of them to choose from, over 80 different um, variations of vector fields. So anyways, that's how you change vector fields. This goes for any vector field for any of the builder packs. So if you have any questions, Feel free to leave a comment, and uh, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video.